hi we are engineering brothers and one second we have come out with the another type of classes over here so i am going to take the opposite route right now i am going to convert the in our previous classes we have just used that the conversion is from binary to decimal right now we are taking the opposite way or opposite path which is decimal to binary conversion over here okay and how to do that so let us do that over here suppose we have considered a decimal number of say 13 okay and what is the base for our decimal number the base is quite naturally the 10 so we are trying to find out for our binary number the base is 2 we are trying to convert the decimal number to binary number over here so what is the exact binary form over here so let us do that first i will consider this number as 13 and after that we have divided this number over here so after i have divided the number with 2 we have got the value is 6 okay and we have a remainder for over here what is the remainder we have got the remainder is what what is the remainder over here the remainder is 1 now once again we will divide the number with 2 we have got this as 3 but you can understand that if you do divide 6 divided by 2 i am going to write it over here 6 divided by 2 means 3 okay so there is no remainder for that condition for that one we should take as 0 okay if there is any remainder is present over there which means that it actually consists of our 1 why because after we have divided this fact 13 divided by our 2 we have got what what is that so 13 this one is 2 6 12 so we have a remainder of 1 that is why we have considered the remainder as 1 similarly for our next one i want to repeat this portion once again first do divide the 13 with our 2 so after we have divided the result is 6 and we have got a remainder which is 1 that is why i have listed the number over here which is been called as our remainder over here now for our next one the next number is 6 okay so this one is 6 2 what is the answer we have got 3 2 main 6 and what is the remainder the remainder is 0 that is why we have written the remainder over here similarly for our next consideration or for our next one we have got the number as 3 now once again the same procedure 3 2 2 1 2 1 we have got the remainder as 1 and the result is also 1 so once again if you do divide the same number we have got the answer is 1 and the remainder is what the remainder is 1 so this is our complete solution over here now how to form the binary number over here this procedure this portion is very very essential over here that is why i have separately considered the classes over here and after that we will do complete some more problems for our decimal to binary conversion over here i want to repeat this portion once again i have got a number which is 13 and after that we have divided the 13 number with 2 and after that the answer is going to be 6 and the remainder is 1 and once again we have keep on dividing these facts so 2 6 divided by 2 means uh, our the complete uh, there is no remainder over here for that condition the 
remainder portion should be 0 and once again 2 divided by 1 and once again the remainder is 1 because 3 is not divisible by 2 only 1 it will be considered as our remainder now how to consider the answer over here you should take this root okay from this to this to get the answer so what is the binary we have got first we should start from this one so one this one is one just do follow the remainder only so one one zero and ultimately the final one is one so this is our exact answer for our number 13 which is been considered as our decimal number okay I want to repeat this portion once again how, how to take or how to consider the binary number over here you should take the opposite path or opposite way to consider the number over here so what is the exact procedure after that we have got the remainder or final remainder as one okay so you should start from this one so one after we have divided the 3 divided by 2 we have got the answer of the result is 1 and the remainder is also 1 so you should start from that uh, result over here so 1 this one is 1 1 0 1 so you should take the opposite way to consider your number as your binary number now uh, you tell me what is the exact procedure to say that that this is the exact number for our 13 I can prove that so I will consider this as our number and as per our previous procedure for our binary to decimal conversion I should named it as what is the position of our 0 uh, of our 1 the position is 0 this one is 1 this one is 2 and this one is 3 now what is the exact decimal number we have got let us do follow our simple procedure so 1 multiplied by 2 to the power 0 plus 0 multiplied by 2 to the power 1 because the 0 what is the position for a 0 the position for a 0 is 1 and once again the same procedure 1 multiplied by 2 square plus 1 multiplied by 2 cube and what is the final value we have got 2 to the power 0 means 1 so 1 multiplied to the 1 means 1 plus this one is 0 plus this one is 4 plus this one is 8 okay so 8 plus 4 plus 1 means finally we have got the proof which is 13 which is nothing but the decimal number over here okay so this is our complete analysis over here I want to repeat this portion once again as we are aiming to convert the decimal to binary conversion so you should divide with 2 and need to find out the remainder for each and every division over here and after that we have started from this number along with this path to get the final answer for our binary number as we are trying to convert the decimal to binary number so this is our final answer over here and in our lower part we have shown you how to take the poop over here and we do know that uh, how to convert the binary to decimal in our previous classes if you have missed my previous six problems over there please do follow that videos on that videos we have covered up all the portions for our analysis so just by using our past procedure we have used or we have numbered the position for our integer digits and after that we have used our old method or old formulation to get the final answer which is this one so this is the proof for our binary number and what is the exact binary number i am going to uh, write down or fill up the blank over here the exact uh, binary number is 1101 so just by using this simple procedure you can analyze or you can convert the decimal to binary conversion over here if you still have any doubts please let us know in the comment section for better understanding and please do subscribe our channel because 
I am guaranteeing you or I am trying to show you that no part of our electrical or electronics or any part of this uh, will not be skipped by me. I am going to cover up all the portions over here. That is why just keep following our channel, hit the like button and please do subscribe our channel and uh, hit the like button uh, and if you have any suggestions regarding our channel or regarding our any part of the video please let us know in the comment section over here we will try our level best to improve our classes okay that's it thank you and goodbye If you like my video, so what are you waiting for? Please do subscribe my channel, hit the bell icon for more updates and stay tuned to the channel. Thank you and goodbye.